Windows 10 installer on a MacBook 4.1, MacBook White 4.1. And uh, here it is. I can confirm that uh, you can also boot from the CD with refit. And uh, well, I first tried to boot with the CD by holding the C. That did not work, so you will need refit installed. But then uh, in the bootloader, you know, if you have the CD in, it will show and then it will also blink for a second and then it will ask you if you want to install Windows on the machine. And then uh, you hit yes, install, and then you will see this logo. As promised, you will have the waiting time. Don't worry about it. And uh, this might take up to one to two minutes depending on you know the processing of the file so when we get to the next point i'm gonna get back to you by the way uh you can see that if you hit the caps lock the light is not going on so we're having the illusion that this thing is stuck. all right this is taking really long but at a certain point you will see that it will continue especially if you're doing this from the CD it takes really long to get to this point but you will get to this point at a certain moment as you can see And we know nothing about drivers yet we don't know nothing about if this will all succeed and at this point we must put in our serial and the rest will go as you saw in my uh, first video i cannot install this on this mac yet because uh, i still have many files that i have to back up uh, it's running mac os lion now so i cannot install uh, this version but i can confirm that it works only thing that you must think of if uh, you're doing this on the MacBook 2.1 and up, the white ones, then you must use the 64-bit installer of Windows 10 or 8.1 if you want to do this, you know, or even 7, because uh, the 32-bit will not boot. You can forget about it, you know, it won't boot. But um, as you could see, the 64-bit 64 booted just fine and uh, we can go ahead and install it now but uh, i will not install it i'm just gonna turn it off boom like that because it's now been confirmed that the installer also boots and you will also be able to install um i think windows 10 as only operating system on the macbook white 4.1 Fantastic, yeah? We have another goal. I thought it would not boot because in the first place with this holding the C it did not show up. It gives the blinking thing but it never came to the to the to the start up uh, screen. And with refit, you know, uh, I, I just popped in the CD and booted uh, turned on the computer and refit found the CD and I just took the last one with the Windows logo and a gray windows kind of boot screen popped up and then um, i got the question if i want to you know install windows on this machine if i want to start the installer just hit it yes and then i got the black screen with something blinking and it was blinking for a very long time this was a fight longer than on the macbook 1.1 a fight between uh, uh, UEVI and EVI, that's how I see it. I try to, you know, visualize it. And I see Windows 10 coming with the new EVI and the old EVI being there, you know, and the new ones coming in. Get out of the way. I, I need to pass. Get out, get out. And it took like at least four minutes uh, to, you know, kick out the old EVI and then boom, uh, show the start screen. Also, the, the keys were locked you could not see no lights if you hit the caps lock you know that's the way how to see if a computer is stuck so in fact it's stuck for at least four minutes and then bang you know windows 10 
boots up and you get to the installer so how it will go i can tell you only in the next part when we actually gonna install uh windows 10 on this macbook because um i need to do some backups first uh, of the mac os x lion uh, distribution that is running now on this macbook so when i'm done doing that you know uh see check my next video make sure to subscribe and check my next video to see the install of windows 10 on the macbook 4.1